This is a Game Caviar production. All right, caviars and caveats. This is Counter Strike Go Beta Gameplay. I came home from work. I downloaded this joint. Uh, it took about 15 minutes to download and install. I did have some trouble uh, at first. I was uh, getting this weird. Uh, I don't. It's a. I guess it's called an error. I don't know. The game would crash periodically. And it took me a while to actually figure that out. So if you have this this game, if you downloaded the beta, and you're having that same issue, the thing that fixed it for me was I had actually put the game into a window. So I put it in uh, not full screen window, but just a regular window. And this is how I got to play a full match without it crashing. Anyway, this is uh, an online gunplay type deal, you know, where you rotate the guns. You have to kill an enemy to uh, advance to the next gun. One of the things that I like about this game mode is that it is extremely fast paced. It is fun. It is It is just, it, my heart was pounding the whole time because you're trying to progress through each weapon and actually win the match. I didn't do too bad in this match, actually. I did fairly well, and it's something that I'm proud of because this is the first time I've ever played a Counter-Strike game. I know, I'm late to the party on Counter-Strike, but I'm here now, and I'm really liking this game. Now, you will notice in this match, there are some bots that are added into the game. Now, this particular match has bots in it, and it has some... Uh, reg real people on the other team the bots play very well it's almost like playing against another human so it's not like they put bots in the game and the bots are like completely stupid or anything now you can play offline with bots just to get acclimated to the game and get used to the controls and everything you can even set the difficulty of the bots and you can play throughout the various game modes that they have and it's really cool it's a good way for you to get used to the game and how it functions and how you uh, are going to act and react to certain situations in the game that's what i used when i was going through my problems with the game crashing and actually trying to get the game to work now they have a um uh, they have an option to where if you have an xbox controller hooked up to your pc you can use that too but i will say this if you use that controller it may not provide the same type of satisfaction that you would get out of using a controller on a console the reason being is because uh, games like this on the computer and call of duty is another one i don't i I, honestly, I don't think you can use a controller with Call of Duty. You have to use some sort of mod. But when people use a mouse and the keyboard or I have a gamepad, it gives them a, a better range of motion and it gives them quicker abilities to turn around and shoot. Whereas if you're using that controller, you won't have the same precise motion as you would with a mouse and a gamepad or a keyboard. I will say that... Uh, I did not get a chance to use the Xbox controller. I opened up the command console and put in the uh, command that was given on the Steam form for Counter-Strike, but it didn't work. I don't know whether that's a bug with this beta. Hopefully they'll get it fixed uh, throughout the, you know, before the game gets uh, released fully. The game comes out later on this month. You can buy it for Steam. It's also on Xbox and PS3. I probably ended up I probably end up getting it on either Xbox or PS3. I don't know which one yet. So uh, keep in mind that I will be doing this. Will be added into the rotation of video games, and you will be seeing a lot of this game, especially this game mode. I'm not a big fan of the other game modes, probably because I've never played Counter Strike, so I'm really not used to them. But I will toy around with them. If you have Counter Strike the uh, the beta, or if you plan on getting this game, let me know exactly uh, if you're gonna get it, it, or and if you are gonna get it, what console are you getting it from? Are you getting it on the Xbox, PS3? or on pc and we'll get together and we can play this game is really fast paced if i do an open lobby with subscribers this will probably be the game type that i will use because i like this one the best and it's really quick you can get a lot of good gameplay in and you can have a lot of fun doing this this is a great game mode and uh the thing that call of duty can get from this is when you have these these uh, uh gunplay games 
put the people in a smaller map. You notice this map is extremely small. I played a match before this one and it was small just like this. It allows for a faster gameplay with more uh, high paced action and gun battles. So as always, like, comment, subscribe, spread the word. Uh, please tell your friends about this video. Let them see it. And then um, let me know what you think. I'm not having it in the Game Caviar Studio and I'm out. This has been a Game Caviar production. Like this video and subscribe for more.